Hello and welcome back to Sleep Hacks. I'm Alexa from Dubs Labs and today we're going to dive into how long a human can actually go without sleep and what happens to your body and mind in the process. Needless to say, don't try this at home. Okay, ideally none of us should go even one night without sleep. But that hasn't stopped many of us from living through and hurting from our procrastination for a night or two or three. While sleep experiments have only gone so far, the famous 1964 sleep deprivation experiment revealed a record of 11 days or 264 hours. Not surprisingly, after that time, the subject began to experience paranoia and hallucination. I think it's safe to say we can all do our part to avoid that, not only for our overall health, but likely in the best interest of everybody around us. Now let's scale this concept down to a level that most of us have actually experienced, 24 hours without any sleep. Researchers have agreed that one day without sleep is comparable to a blood alcohol level of 0.1%. So after your all-nighter, maybe consider a nap instead of a leisurely drive to keep you awake. Other symptoms after a day of exhaustion include decreased memory, irritability, duh, and decreased hand-eye coordination. While we don't know how long exactly it would take a human to experience death directly from sleep deprivation, your chances of being involved in an accident from extreme exhaustion are significantly increased. And if you ask me, you're about 100 times more likely to angry cry at everything. So let's just all agree to try to get some sleep, even in the most stressful of times. And hey, if you do pull an all-nighter, we've got your back. We have videos on how to improve your bedtime routine to fall asleep better and faster, and even a video on how to make it through the next day after an all-nighter. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on all things sleep packs, and we'll see you next time. Sleep well.